How's it going everyone? It's Jason AK Von Nola and you're watching video number five and my blockchain series that I'm doing for you guys. I, I'm hoping you're liking the content. I'm hoping you are going after watching these videos and studying. You know, it's important to study guys, you know. There's not just one blockchain. There's Bitcoin, there's Ethereum, there's there's color coin, there's light coin, there's dragon chain, there's there's so many different chains out there. How can we make the chains communicate? How can how can I trade? How can how can we do business with each other with different type of blockchains and still maintain the integrity and security that the blockchain offers? So there's this group that made this application called Proof. And what Proof is, it's a it's a blockchain asset management tool essentially what it is. So for example, you say as go, I want to buy your land and your land is on a blockchain ledger and I want to buy it with my Bitcoin. So with proof, you and me, we, can, we both make an account with proof and I, I put in a request to purchase your land on the Say for example, the country of Georgia, because land deeds are on the blockchain. So, I, hey, I want to purchase an acre of land that you have in Georgia. Okay, so we go on proof, we make an account. I put in a request to give you 10 Bitcoin for your land, and you receive this, you receive my offer, and you say, okay, I, I see your offer and I accept it. So then, with using proof, because proof essentially is a side chain, that keeps record, that keeps track of the exchanges with the different blockchains. So with your land deed on, on a separate blockchain and my Bitcoin on a different blockchain, Proof handles the transaction. Proof, all right, cool. Boom, swaps the ownership. So you take ownership of my Bitcoin, I take ownership of your land, and it's done. Now there's more technical stuff that goes into it, but the creators of Proof, they're making it very user-friendly where you don't have to see all that technical stuff that goes on. All you need to do is request an asset from another blockchain in exchange for your asset on a different blockchain to complete the transaction. It's as simple as make a user login, hit a button, hey, I'm requesting this asset, select the type of asset, and let Proof do the work for you. So like I said, you can find out more about Proof. I'll put the links in the description and we'll you know, hook, hook you up so you can look more into this awesome application that now unifies all the different blockchains. Because now it's no longer, oh, my blockchain is better than your blockchain. It's, hey, we can all work together with different secure blockchains that is keeping accurate records of everyone's transactions. Thank you for watching. And if you haven't already, subscribe to our email list at www.jasonvhomes.com. And if you'd like more information on the 2017 Outlook on um, blockchain impact on enterprise and government, go to www.thinkconsortium.com where you can get more information on the things I'm talking about. And also, this videos and all these other videos in this series was sponsored by Kimchi Socks, who accepts Bitcoin for their products. Thank you and share.